guys, my name is Kelly and I write about petite fashion over at alterationsneeded.com. Today, I'm gonna talk a little bit about shopping for leather jackets. So to give you some perspective, I'm about four foot 11 inches tall. Uh, so that makes shopping pretty challenging. Today, I'm gonna share with you some of the tricks that I've learned along the way in the hopes that it makes your shopping easier as well. Tip number one, you don't wanna to have to alter leather if you don't have to. Especially when it comes to leather jackets, there's usually zippers on the sleeve. You really don't wanna to have to alter that. Uh, it can be expensive, it can be difficult. So your best bet is to try and find the best fit you can right off the rack. Tip number two, look for the word cropped. Jackets that are cropped or shrunken are gonna be shorter in the sleeve and shorter in the torso. So that means it has a better chance of fitting you in all the right spots. So there's two really easy ways to do this. If you're shopping online, look for the word cropped or look for the word shrunken in the product description. You can often just pop it into a search bar. Or look at the models in the product images and you can tell when it's a shrunken fit, you'll be able to see the model's wrist or the jacket will come up kind of high on her waist or on, on her torso. That's a really good indication that the jacket has a cropped fit and that the jacket will fit a little shorter in the areas that you need them. This jacket is a really great example. If you look at how it fits on the model, it was super short on her arm, super short on her torso. I knew just from looking at the product images that this was gonna be a great fit. So this jacket's a little less obvious, but if you look at how it fits on the model, you can see it fits her a little high on the wrist and a little high on her torso. That was a pretty good clue. Tip number three, look for sizing clues. Most garments are usually sized either numerically, so it'll be double zero, zero, two, four, and above, or letter sizing, so that'll be extra small, small, medium, large. Uh, in my experience, clothing that is sized numerically, so again, that's a double zero, zero, two, four, um, are, they're usually cut more precise than the letter sizing. Letter sizing is usually cut more generous. Uh, so one size, say size extra small, is usually cut to fit a range of numerical sizes. So I found that the more precise number sizing has a way better chance of fitting me the way I want. Last tip, reviews. If a website allows reviews, take advantage of that and just take a skim through them and see if anyone has mentioned anything about how that item fits on petites. Some of my favorite clothing finds were discovered just because another petite left a helpful review. And that's it. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments below. Or if you follow me on Instagram, my DMs are always open. I'll be sharing more tips and tricks here in the future, so feel free to subscribe.